Your first assignment is going to be to download a working version of Rhino 6 onto whatever computer you are using. So the first thing that we're going to do is open up a browser and come to this website right here, www.rhino3d.com slash download. This will bring you to this page and you're going to come down and decide are you using a PC or are you using a Mac? If you're using a Mac, you're going to come click on this link right here, Rhino 6 for Mac Evaluation. If you have a PC, then you will click on Rhino 6 for Windows Evaluation. These are both free 90-day trial versions of Rhino, which will work for us to finish out the school year. So, I have a PC. I'm going to click on Rhino 6 for Windows, and it's going to bring me to this next page. On this page, you're going to enter your email address. Make sure you use an email address that you can log into because you're going to need to access the email that gets sent to you. So I'm going to enter my email address. And you guys all have sickaschools.org email addresses as well if you want to use those. Click on Next, and it will bring you to a screen that says, Go check your email. So come to your email, and in your email, you should have an email from... Brian Gillespie. In this email right here, you're going to have a link to download the Rhino 6 evaluation. And then down here, you will have a license code to use for your download. So if you have a laptop from the school, you should have already had Rhino 6 downloaded on your computer. You just need a license code to enter. So you're going to double click on the link or the icon on your desktop. And when Rhino opens, you're going to enter in this access license code. If you have your own computer at home, then you're going to click on this download link. It's going to download this for you. When you've finished downloading it, double click and run through the install. And then when you get to the place where it asks you for a license code, copy this, paste it in, and you should have a working copy of Rhino 6 now on your home computer. If you have any questions, send me a message in PowerSchool or on Teams or send me an email.